Hey there, Kathleen from Masters of Marketplace here with another training video all about how to sell on Amazon. So today we're gonna to be talking about what are the exceptional qualities that every Amazon store manager has. So you may be asking, first off, what is an Amazon store manager? An Amazon store manager is somebody who just like it sounds like manages an Amazon store. So this could be you managing your own Amazon store. This could be you offering a service to another business to manage their Amazon store. Um, that's what I do in my consulting agency, Cobal Consulting. We offer services to businesses who just don't quite understand how to sell on Amazon. They know they need to get their products up there. They know they need to claim that space on Amazon before someone else does, um, but they just don't understand the ins and outs of selling on Amazon, or they just simply don't have the time and don't need to learn because they're the CEO and the business owner. So that's where you and I come in and that we can help other businesses by being their Amazon store manager or their Amazon business consultant. So what do you need? What qualities do you need to become a good Amazon store manager? Well, besides learning the skill of selling on Amazon, which is of course the number one thing that you need to have in order to offer that service, I highly recommend you go to my site, mastersofmarketplace.com, and check out all the trainings. And if you're really serious about it, sign up for the membership. It's a very low cost monthly fee that gives you access to a crazy amount of trainings, plus live office hours with me, monthly live trainings, Facebook group, all this great stuff. But anyway, what do you need to have besides knowing how to sell on Amazon? What are the skills that you need to have in order to become a really good store manager? So I have three things that I've picked out that I think are the most valuable personality traits um, or skills that you need to have. So the first one that's so important is that you just, you want to have a yearning for knowledge. You want to be always having continuing education. Uh, you always want to be open to learning something new. Amazon is constantly changing. They're changing their terms. They're growing. Uh, they're, they're doing so many different things that they're beta testing right now for sellers, different programs. So as an Amazon store manager, you need to be able to keep up with the latest things that Amazon is doing so that you can offer them to your clients. If you know about programs that your clients don't even know about, they're gonna think you're amazing because you're coming to them with this news of opportunities for them to help them grow their business. So make sure that you just love learning and that you are fine with um, not having like in every day, this is what I do, mundane, boring, day to day. And that's okay if you do. Some people love that, and there's nothing wrong with that. But as an Amazon store manager, you need to be able to stay on the up and up and really want to keep learning continuously about how to become better at selling on Amazon. Okay, the second thing is that you need to be able to adopt and roll with the punches. So kind of like the last quality, you know, Amazon's always changing. So we are constantly finding this in my consulting agency. We've done something 10, 20, 100 times and then the 101st time we go to do it, it's completely changed. And that's on purpose by Amazon. They're going to keep you on your toes. And again, this is why your position as an Amazon store manager is so needed by small business owners because they don't have time for that. So you need to stay on the up and up. You need to be able to roll with the punches and adapt to Amazon's ever-changing terms, their ever-changing opportunities, programs, things like that. So the third thing that is super important is that you need to be organized, you need to be consistent, you need to have excellent follow through skills. There are a lot of things that go on at Amazon where you need to contact their support and then follow up. There's a lot of things that you need to go back and check on to make sure that Amazon is holding up their end of the bargain because they're not going to follow up with you. You need to be following up with them. So you need to have exceptional follow up, follow through skills, stay consistent. You know, for example, if you have an issue with one of your product listings, say you contact Amazon seller support, they don't get back to you after 48 hours, you have to be able to go in there and say, hey, how is this progressing? I need an update. Or can someone please let me know what's going on? They may you know, send you an email and say, we're still working on this, but you need to be the one that's following up and following through with everything. So those are the three main qualities that you need to have if you wanna become an Amazon store manager. Oh, and the fourth one is customer service. 
You have to be good at customer service. While it's not gonna be a huge part of your job, you need to be able to answer emails nicely. You need to be able to understand that the customer is always right because they're always right in Amazon's eyes. So they always need to be right in your eyes as a seller or in your client's eyes as a seller, right? So make sure that you just love interacting with customers, not necessarily on the phone, but via email um, or, or chat. So people will ask questions too. You need to be able to respond to questions that people are asking about your products or your client's products. Um, so that is also really important too. So those are my four things. One is you want to love learning. You need to be okay with continually educating yourself on what's the latest, newest thing with Amazon. You also need to be able to be flexible and roll with the punches so that when things do change, you're able to adapt and just quickly create a new system or a new process um, that keeps your store going. You also need to have exceptional follow through skills. You need to be detail oriented and consistent. You need to follow up with Amazon because they're not going to follow up with you. And the fourth thing that's so important is customer service. You need to be able to know how to talk to customer service um, via typing or writing. So that means that your, your language skills need to be very good as far as uh, writing uh, in whatever language you're offering your services to for the store. Um, so customer service is also very important. So those are four things. If you have those four qualities, you very well can become a very successful Amazon store manager. Again, I did not highlight the fact that you need to know how to sell on Amazon. You need to learn this skill. And I highly recommend you go to my site, mastersofmarketplace.com and join the membership in order to do that. Um, there are more resources there uh, than you probably could ever want. Um, and it's a, really great, it's a really great site because if you're offering this as a service to clients, uh, we have the Facebook group where people can come and ask questions, get support. Um, there's always things that come up that we're not 100% sure on. So it's nice to have that extra support network, the extra trainings, courses, all that good stuff. So come visit me over at mastersofmarketplace.com if you want to become an Amazon store manager. Highly recommend you do. That's what I do. I've built my entire consulting agency around offering Amazon as a service and I've done very well with it and I really love it. I love working with small businesses and I love helping the small businesses grow online. It's all these big box retailers are just shutting down. It's so sad. And I want to make sure that, you know, part of something that I do to contribute to the universe, to our world, um, is to help those small businesses get their online presence solidified and the best way I know how to do that is to sell on Amazon. So come join me over at mastersofmarketplace.com for all of your Amazon selling needs and, uh, and subscribe to the channel. I do a new video every single week. New video comes out on Tuesday, training just like this. So subscribe to make sure that you get the one first thing next week. Okay, thanks for watching.